What's up guys, this episode features two five cents from our collection, both minted in 1964. Look at the mesmerizing contrast between these two. Let's start with description of one to the right. Coin is in very good condition. It was bought by Isal Khasov, the founder of the coin us, several years ago, in this state. To be honest, I am not a numismatic expert, but I can dare say that this full dark upper surface may be result of so-called black beauty error the numismatic holy grail as they say. Black beauty errors occur as a result of improper annihilation during the minting process. You can ask what exactly is improper annihilation. Well, improper annihilation means strips used to impress the coin planchets were overheated which resulted in such dark grey tone. Black beauty or not, I'll happily read your opinions in comment section. Other probability is that it has massive carbon all around the fields, mostly on northern half and some bulges on the device. Back to the coin's physical features, struck on a copper nickel planchet, it weighs 5 grams, has diameter of 21.2 millimeters. Of worse features, the porter Thomas Jefferson, the third president of the United States, legends in God we trust to the left, liberty and date to the right. Letterings are stark, even though show some rubbing on high points. Several dents and deep contact marks on Jefferson head. Also dent is seen on the northwestern rim. On the reverse, central device, Monticello, representation of Jefferson residence. Legends around, lettering Monticello and face value in full. Again mysterious black matter on the southern half of the coin. Black beauty error or carbon, let the experts decide. Monticello shows significant wear on the most parts, no sign of steps. Fields and device exhibit several seen and long marks and plentiful of hairlines. I looked for Black Beauty Jefferson from 1964 and found several specimens that are sold for between $5 to $30. For instance, this one has a starting bid at $20 but can be bought for $30 up front. Moving along to other coins, it was also impressed in 1964, there is no mint mark. Coin is at extremely fine condition, high points of design show light wear and bits of luster visible in protected areas. Two deep marks seen on the bust of the president. Dark lake green patina is formed around the date and the legend, Liberty. Reverse device displays heavy rubbing, we can't distinguish the steps here as well. Letterings are well struck and show lesser wear than in previous one. Major dent on the rim at northwest edge. According to PCGS price guide, 1964 Jefferson nickels at grades below 62 are worth not more than $7. Value of higher grades are as shown on the screen. That's all for now. If you really liked the video, don't forget to push the thumbs up. See you later, guys.